Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video and today we're going to be ranking the F1 2021 liveries. Now I'm not just by myself because I'm not capable of doing this by myself but I got a little guest, little friend of the channel, Mr. Aidan Rule. How are you doing mate? Hello I'm Gucci, I'm loving life. We're at home now so there's no little fireplace that's usually behind me so feel a bit out of my element but it's nice to not have an echoey room for a change so yeah I'm doing well. As you would know we're going to be looking at the F1 2021 liveries. We've got the tiers, we've got, we've got Goat, Nice, Mare, Stinker, and Ferrari, because self-explanatory. <laughs> Trash. And basically we're just gonna just rank them, and then you guys can let us know in the comments what you think below. We're also gonna post on Twitter as well at the end, so you can have a little, have a little share with everyone, because everyone needs to know how amazing this tier list is. Yeah, we love a good debate. We have a good debate. Let's get straight into it. First one is the Hass. The Russian, the Russian. The American team with the Russian flag on it, yeah. <laughs> that, yeah. What do you think of the Haas? What's your thoughts on it? At first, I was like, I don't know. But then I saw like more photos. I like the went from the top angle. It was all like symmetrical. Everything yeah. was all the same. And I really like that. But I don't think this is bad. On board, it looks quite nice with all the sponsors when they was racing. I didn't mind it, but I think it's still like a meh for me. Yeah, I thought it was a banger when it first when it first dropped. I thought it was a banger. It looked so good in the renders, and then as soon as I saw it on track, I just didn't really like it as much. It just it looked too white. The things I don't know it just didn't look right. So yeah, I think meh's a, a fair fair one for that. At first, I was like nah, because it looked kind of plain. Yeah. Just Russian, Russian. But then I was like, I don't know. And I started to like it, but then I didn't like it on track. But the only thing I liked the onboard for some reason, just like the way that it was like, because it's just white with the sponsors, but I, for some reason it kind of looked kind of cool for me. I don't know why. Or two sponsors that the team have. Yeah, it's still not up there though. It's, it's, it's only a meh. Now we got the Aston Martin. I feel like this will be a, a spicy one. What are you thinking? Where are you? Where would you put it? See, I'm saying nice. I'm saying nice as well, because from some pictures, it does look goated, it looks really nice, but then in other lights it doesn't look great. So I feel like, because, you know what I mean, in some lights it looks meh, some lights it looks goat, so I can just whack it in nice, call it quick to so get the comment section angry, because people love this livery, like, a lot, which, I mean, it is nice, but, uh, yeah, it's just, just nice. <laughs> it needs the right lighting to look good. Yeah, literally, it, it, when it's, like, from the distance, it just looks like a Mercedes, then it gets close and you see, oh, it's actually green. Yeah. Direct sunlight looks right, but then when I first saw it, I was like, like it's a nice colour, but it, it was literally just green with a stripe on yeah. it. Yeah, it is quite a simple design, but it does work, but yeah, definitely not go. It's a nice colour in, in direct sunlight, yeah, it's not go. Let's just whack Ferrari in there, right? We all know the green looks naff. I don't like the dark burgundy. I don't think you like it either, to be honest, so whack it in Ferrari. No more comments needed, I don't think. From the front, I think it looks yeah, alright. the front's alright. It's red, like, it's red and it's, black. It's the size. What are they doing? They just ruined it. Like, it's the, the crappy little gradient. And then the green. I don't, I don't no think reason. actually classifies as a gradient because it's so sharp. It's as if they're just like, oh, I don't even know. I, I could talk for hours about how naff it is, honestly. <laughs> It's so bad. Right, next one is Alfa Romeo. Goat or nice for me. I really yeah, like I do it. really like. I think I feel like goat should only be one car, really. So I think nice. Yeah, okay. Nice okay. is definitely up there. Yeah. I would probably oh, put oh, it above above Aston. Above Aston, Aston yeah. In my livery video, I put Aston above. Did you? Yeah, but I think like. I overrated it a bit. So when you see a good picture of it, it can really go up there. But like, realistically, generally speaking, the Alpha is much better. I guess if we're talking overall all the time rather than certain angles. Yeah. But I saw a render, right, where it was Alpha Romeo, but they had red instead of the white at the bottom. And it looked really nice. It looked a lot better with a bit more red. Yeah, definitely. The front end left it down a little bit, but it's still a nice looking livery. Next one, Williams. This one's weird because I feel like I would have put this the bottom of I would have put it below Ferrari when it first got dropped. In, in that yeah, picture, yeah, like the yeah, renders yeah. of it were absolutely awful. Like I genuinely hated it. But then now I keep seeing it on track. I'm like almost tempted to put it in nice because I see some pictures and I'm like that oh, is wow. quite, that is quite a nice looking car. I don't know. I feel like I can't put it above Met. I would put it above the Haas, I reckon. Which I'm shocked with because I still put it night for my own rankings. But the more and more pictures yeah. I see of it, I'm like it is quite a nice looking car. I was completely the same. When I first saw that, I think it's because the renders literally like 360p. They look, they look terrible. It didn't look nice at all. But then it does look a lot better on track. The only thing that really puts me off with it though, apart from the weird stripes, is the fact that a big black yeah, chunk that's, just that cut is out very of nowhere. weird. It's a bit of an odd one, but yeah. Like they didn't even. It, it's just black. <laughs> yeah, I reckon put it below Haas actually. I think I got a bit keen, but yeah, below Haas, but definitely still a mess. Definitely a. It's a lot nicer than when I first saw it. I've definitely grown on me yeah, a lot. Yeah, true. I don't know, you know, it could be better See, than See, I keep Hass. thinking it might be better than Hass, but I feel like I just... Oh, I don't know. I gave it a 2 out of 10 in my live reaction. I can't get put it above. I gave the Hass a 7. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh. 
Okay. Heads all over the shop, lads, when it comes to deliveries. Honestly, corner to corner, it can change. <laughs> we can always change it. Yeah. Then. We'll leave it there for now. We'll see how the rest of the... Alpha Towery. I personally think Stinker. See, I think Stinker in that, like, compared to last year, it's a Stinker. From the front, though, it's abs it's banging. Like, from the yeah. front end, you're looking down, it looks really cool. It's just the side and the white wheels, but I reckon bottom of meh, maybe. Possibly it's top of Stinker, but it does look really cool from the front, so I don't want to hate on it too much. It's grown on me anyway. It looks a lot better in real life than it did in the renders. The renders it didn't do much justice. But I think from the front, it looked, when from a distance, you're like, is that a Mercedes? Oh, oh, no, it's an Alpha Tower. <laughs> yeah, it's very dark. It does look cool, though. Yeah, I quite, I quite like the white. Yeah, I, I wouldn't mind either way. I'm between Matt and Stinker, honestly. I think Stinker for now, personally. I saw Tomo, Tomo yeah, did a Stinker. redesign, and it was so much better. And I was like, that's what they should have done. Makes a change for Tomo. <laughs> All I do is insult this bloke, honestly. That he, this mid twenties bloke just gets so much abuse from me, honestly. Yeah, we have a segment, man. just the Tom or Royce, just have a go for no reason. All I've got to do, just keep insulting him, and then he replies to me, and I get, I get, you know, attention and subs. So we just get a slight DM <laughs> going. Oh, it's the master plan. <laughs> Engagement to another level, right? McLaren. Nice, solid car, same as last year, but it's it's really nice. Yeah, I get the, it. The blue, the new yeah. added blue actually is a bit. I mean, it literally is the same, but it, I do rate it. What do we put? I, I don't like the extra bits of blue they oh, put don't. on it, but it still looks really good. So I reckon I put it above both of those above. two. Nice. Yeah, I, I, I think say the I, I didn't there. rate it that much, but then maybe it's just whenever oh. I see a picture of the orange, I might just be like a child and really like orange, but it just looks it so does cool. Look good on track. I don't know. It's definitely nice. Put it below the alpha because it's not new. <laughs> they lose points. Okay, I lose points for originality. Talk about originality. Red Bull. But that one is that is a sexy livery. You can't deny that is a sexy car. Yeah, but I think it's because I'm bored of it now. I've seen it too many times. I, I do mean, like the true. big Honda on the back, though. The Honda yeah, looks that really looks, nice. I, the on Honda the back. looks sick. But I'm, I, I, think I don't I'm bored think I could it. let you put it any lower than nice, honestly. It's a nice livery, but it's, I think I'm just bored. Yeah, I get that. I'm either mare or bottom of nice. I'll accept bottom of nice, but I will be salty about it. <laughs> <laughs> it oh, got, no. Oh, it slipped us where it should be up there and go. Tear Maker was having none of it. Was having none of it. Oh, God. I, th I think it's just the boredom for me. Yeah, just, I think that's it's fair. It's the same as the last God knows how many years. Speaking of switching it up, this is one that didn't go well. AMG, AMG, AMG. The front end actually looks quite nice. I like the new number they've it got, does. which is like, it's like there's no in inners. It's just the outline around it. It looks very cool, but literally as soon as you get past like the driver's seat, it's just trash, absolute trash. The red <laughs> looks really weird. It's a bit too red. Yeah. Like last year they had like a... What was it, like a wine colour red, wasn't it? But now it's like a very yeah. Ferrari red. And I mean, the AMG thing doesn't look good. The silver looks white. <laughs> it just isn't ever like a nice looking car. Whack it in stinker. Bottom of stinker. Leave it there. Like, from certain angles, it doesn't look too bad, but I'm not a fan of AMG, though. Uh, they, they have ruined it a bit there. The, what was wrong with the stars? The stars were beautiful. The stars were beautiful. Bottom of there. But you put it above the Alpha Tauri. I, th I think it's Alpha better. Alpha Tauri is better than Mercedes. I, I don't know. I, don't, I think, right, the thing on my mind is the Mercedes looks better from certain angles, but when you see it from a bad angle, it's really bad, whereas the Alpha Tauri just looks a bit off Ooh. from certain mm. angles, not really bad, I think. They're both off in certain angles. Yeah, but I think Mercedes looks off in like, it doesn't look like it should be there, whereas Alpha Tauri looks off just because I don't like that design, I think. But the only problem is the numbers. You said you like the numbers, but you can't see them when they're driving. That's true. Especially the back, like it's just. <laughs> if you're gonna put it above Alpha Tower, you still gotta put it in Stinker. I'll okay. allow it if it's in Stinker. Okay, okay, I can back that. I can back that. And the last one's pretty easy. I mean, we left the goat here just for this car, I think. Da, 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 da. Da, da, what a glorious it, car! It's gorgeous. What a lovely car! It's so nice. I do think it looks better in the renders than it does a bit on track though. Yeah, it's a bit it's a bit more matte than shiny in real life. Yeah. Which, it still looks alright though, and obviously their big chunky airbox they got going on doesn't do any favours, but Oh, that's chunky. I mean, it, you can't get a better looking F I don't think there's anything wrong with it at all. Like, it's not even like a slight bit on it I don't really like. But like how they've like got a bit of red here, they've kind of switched up red Putting on that black bit on the front stuff. half has actually done bits for them. Like I feel like if it was all blue it would have looked a bit weird. But yeah, I'm I'm fairly happy with that list, to be fair. I'm happy with it. Let me know what it's like, what you guys think in the comments down below. I think we've got what we've got to do last time is switch it up to try and piss off the community. Yeah. Right, I reckon the Alpine's got to be in like meh. Anything below meh would be obviously like it looks too bait. Wrap top that of in meh. Mm, top of meh? Top of meh, can't be too bait. But put the Aston in the bottom of meh. Oh no, top of stinker. Top of stinker. 
Then put the Merc to nice. Top of nice. Can we put the hat in go? Hat in go. <laughs> Fair people get really mad at that. I feel like that's good enough. <laughs> that looks like it moved. could be real. Wait, the McLaren fans are always really loud, so put that in stinker as well. We just hate stinker. all the fan favourite teams at this point. I mean, I feel that looks quite believable in like a bad way. I, I think I, I'm quite happy with that. I feel like someone's taste is bad enough for it to look like that, so. Well, there you are, lads. That was our rankings of all the cars. Let us know in the comment section down below if you agree or disagree. And if you do disagree, make sure to leave a very angry and heated comment, which I'm sure he will reply to, and then the engagement goes up again. <laughs> <laughs> it's all about the engagement. <laughs> Mind blown. So thank you, everyone, for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. Make sure to check out Aiden. Link in the description. And have a, have a good rest of your day, and goodbye. CBA, never